my, uh, my drills are dying. <laughs> I got batteries now. Do you have any other masonry bits? Yeah. Jerseys? I've got a quad in the path of progress. That's the topic of today's show. Let's dive in. Hey, real estate investors, welcome to another episode of the Investment Properties for Sale show here on Holton Wise TV. As always, I am your host, James Wise. Right now, I'm coming to you guys from my home office because of all the issues with the coronavirus, but not to fear, guys. We are still all systems that go for you. The property that I've got for you, 3424 Poe Avenue, Cleveland, Ohio, 44109. Now, this quad, folks, this is uh, priced at a discount, 99900 Now, this is because the particular property, it needs a little bit of work, okay? Cruising upstairs, right? We have two residential units. Both of these units are in solid shape, okay? Looking good. We already got the hardwoods. We got the neutral colors. So we have to do nothing or very, very minimal things to get these rent ready, right? Nothing that I can really see from the footage from my film crew here uh, that's anything out of the ordinary, okay? Now, of course, when you guys purchase properties from us, you're going to want to do a private third-party home inspection, number one. In addition, before we can actually place tenants in these properties, my team is going to go in and do the unit safety check, make sure everything meets the Holton Wise minimum rental standard. So there may be a couple things uh, that come up, right? You know, from what we're seeing here, it's hard to tell, you know, tiny little things such as like, are there enough smoke detectors? Are all the batteries in the smoke detectors good? Uh, when we open the windows, do they freely open and close or do some of them, um, you know, do they need like a stick in there, right? I think what uh, we should do with these units is go section eight on them. I believe we'll probably get 700 right now and I anticipate that's actually going to go up even further, right? Because this particular property, guys, this is in the path of progress. A lot of people uh, who've been working with me privately one-on-one, -on -one, a lot of folks, uh, you know, we got the whole coronavirus thing going on, right? So what we did, because, you know, here's the thing, right? You guys, you see me, I'm in the home, home office. I don't want you guys to think things are not all systems of go here at Holton Wise, right? We are still out there. Our, our sales and media staff, yeah, we're working off-site just because we can. Uh, we're trying to, you know, stay with all the state guidelines and, the, you know, recommendations from the CDC, things of that nature. Uh, so non-essential uh, sales and media staff that can do the same job off-site, they're doing it off-site. But real estate, <clears throat> real estate investing, contracting, things of that nature, guys, this is an exempt business. You know, these are um, essential workers. So my field team, guys, they are still working all systems to go. I mean, you got one of my guys wearing a mask out there. You know, we're, we're doing our best to stay safe, okay? Uh, but we are still able to handle everything. You guys, you don't have to slow down your investing. You can put properties under contract. We can do full renovations for you. Nothing is stopping here at Holton Wise. And as a matter of fact, like I was trying to get into there before I started rambling, folks that have been working with me privately since the coronavirus pandemic started, I've been offering a sale on my MLS search analysis show. That's the show where unlike this, where you just see the properties and you just bid on them, that is the one where I actually take your criteria, what you want to do. And I work with you one-on-one -on -one to try to build you a portfolio of properties that are, you know, from properties that are listed elsewhere, right? These are, and that show, those are properties that Holton Wise has nothing to do with, right? We are only working for you. We are scouring the MLS. If you have properties sent to you by wholesalers, for sale by owners, things of that nature, we're giving you an unbiased opinion. And since the coronavirus started popping off, I offered a sale I've never done before. 10 properties for $1,999. As long as you see me working from this home studio office, and as long as we have coronavirus restrictions in place in the United States of America, that sale is going to remain active at 75% off. Normally for that type of service, we charge you guys $7.99 per property. So 10 properties for two k never going to see a sale like that again. So if you're interested in a a more one-on-one -on -one experience, um, a more back-and-forth experience other than just browsing the inventory, you want to check that out. You go to holtonwise.com, property search for sale tab, click the MLS search analysis show to order your package. But back to this particular property, right? So in that, where I'm talking to a lot of those guys, we've been talking a lot about this neighborhood, right? 
this neighborhood and a lot of guys that I'm personally working with, they already know this because, you know, that's what we're doing, right? I'm trying to find them deals that are going to, you know, go up in the future, right? This particular neighborhood, it is right next door to Metro Health. Metro Health, folks, you know, I'm not a big spec guy unless there is a specific reason that makes me believe that there should be some appreciation, right? You come to Cleveland for cash flow. You don't come here for appreciation. But sometimes certain little submarkets they're going to shift, and I think this is the one that's going to do it in Cleveland. If I'm going to bank on any shifting in any Cleveland cash flow market, it is this one because right next to Metro Health there, Metro Health, guys, they're investing $1 billion. That is be like boy, not million, billion, be like boy, okay? They're investing a billion bucks into their campus and the surrounding neighborhood, you know, putting more affordable housing. In addition to that, up north, this area borders the hot spots of Cleveland, the places that have already gentrified. When you're looking at the resurgence of Cleveland on the national scale, Ohio City, Gordon Square, Detroit Shoreway, Edgewater, Tremont. These are the hot popular neighborhoods where the prices used to be very, very low. And now you can find homes in the three, four, five, six, seven hundred thousand dollar range. Okay. So right directly to the north, we have all of that. <clears throat> right in the neighborhood, just to the east of us, we have one billion dollars being injected into this neighborhood. South of us, we have old Brooklyn, solid C class neighborhood. And over to the west, we got Camps Corner, Lakewood, Rocky River, Fairview. So this in a 360 degree radius is surrounded by things that are pulling this up. And then we're going to go ahead and inject a billion bucks into this neighborhood. I think it's going to be solid. So right now, since it's still a little high risk, I think the move we take those two residential apartments, rent out for 700 bones a month to Section 8 tenants, alleviate our current level of risk while we ride out the appreciation, okay? While we ride out the gentrification that I think is coming, okay? We'll get some consistent cash flow, the most consistent cash flow we can get through our Section 8 program through those two residential units. Now, as far as the downstairs, the reason I've discounted the property is the downstairs, it's two commercial spaces, okay? You know, the market rent for these <clears throat> is going to be about 600 bucks a month. But hey, you know, I've been talking about COVID, right? Coronavirus. Now, now's not the time. Uh, you know, now's not the appropriate time uh, to open up a, a, a small business in a little space like this, right? Like this neighborhood, you know, things that do really, really well for us in these neighborhoods, barber shops, beauty shops, nail shops, tattoo parlors, things like that. Well, you know, dude, you know, now it's not exactly the time people are trying to open those. So, uh, you know, you're either going to have to just uh, kind of sit on these for a while, maybe rent them out as storage for, you know, two, 300 bucks, uh, things like that. If you wanted to throw 30, 40, 50 K uh, into it, we could probably turn them into one very large apartment down there or perhaps two apartments, but you got to go through a lot of red tape, get the, you know, the, the building use changed uh from mixed use to residential to do that so you know with all those slowdowns i i would say the move is not to do anything with the downstairs immediately i'd probably just ride it out you know you're going to be able to make enough money off just the two units above for the sucker to cash flow 1400 bucks a month for a hundred thousand dollar investment i mean that's a no-brainer right there and then we get lucky and all the things i think are going to happen to this neighborhood maybe five six years things have really gone up you know, then you might want to look into your options on that downstairs space. I don't think it makes a lot of sense to do anything with it right now uh, before a lot of things happen. I think you just kind of sit on that. So that's this property, folks. Uh, I think it could be a great spec play for out-of-state investors. We'll handle the PM, all that jazz. Also a great move for uh, local folks. You know, maybe you're a local contractor and uh, you need a, a spot for your, your home office, you're trying to expand your business because, you know, even though COVID's going on, that's not slowing us contractors down. So maybe you want to uh, have your office on the downstairs and you want to pay for the building uh, with the rent coming in from upstairs. I don't know. It could work for both, guys. <clears throat> so if you're a local and you got your own real estate agent, we're going to put this on the MLS as well. Uh, showing information is going to be on there. Just have your agent check out the showing notes uh, on the MLS. They could do that. Uh, everybody else who's just ready to make offers, guys, you want to send your offers to sales at HoltonWise.com. Have your proof of funds or your pre-approval letters ready. You know, my residential folks, you're going to want to talk to your uh, lenders, right? Quads are amazing, 30-year financing, but we do have two commercial units, so that could cause a problem with your traditional residential lenders. I have commercial lenders that are good with mixed-use stuff. 
Uh, so if you're interested in getting my list of lenders, people that could loan on buildings like this, sales at holtonwise.com, let us know. We'll get you our list. If you want to pay cash, that would be great. Sales at holtonwise.com, include your proof of funds, and then my team will get everything going for you guys. I anticipate multiple offers coming in, right? We got just a ton of good stuff here, right? Yes, it cash flows today. Yes, it's a perfect Section 8 investment. And yes, of all the areas in Cleveland, I think this has got the best chance for a ton of appreciation. So this really allows you guys to get your cake and eat it too. So again, sales at holdingwise.com, have your ducks in a row. I anticipate a ton of competition. Other than that, uh, continue watching the show for other options. And if you really want to dive deep and get uh, to working with me one-on-one -on -one again, check out the MLS Search Analysis Show. Grab yourself that 10 property package, which is 75% off right now. That's all I've got for today's show. As always, I'm James Wise with Holton Wise, and this is Real Estate Investing Made Easy. Rent Tech Direct provides you with an easy to use yet robust platform for managing your properties, complete with its built-in reporting and accounting system that can be customized to fit your business. You can manage work orders and even accept them online from your tenants. You can also share work order details with tenants or owners if you wish. With Rent Tech Direct, you will also fill your vacancies faster than ever with the built-in marketing tools. Just enter the details of your property and Rent Tech will automatically provide you with a professional online website as well as syndicate them to popular websites such as Zillow, Trulia, and Apartments.com to get your listing maximum exposure so it's rented fast. U.S. REIB is a full-service turnkey provider offering investors the opportunity to purchase single-family and multi-family investment properties in Cincinnati, Ohio, Dayton, Ohio, and Kansas City, Missouri. The purchase process is seamless, from reserving a property to obtaining financing, inspections, and insurance referrals, U.S. REIP has a dedicated team in place to manage the process from start to finish. In addition, U.S. REIP is also directly integrated with its own private placement fund for accredited investors. The fund seeks to raise $10 million to capitalize on the repositioning of distressed single-family and multifamily real estate. Over 50% of those living in the greater Memphis area rent their home. This fact combined with the high price to rent ratio is why Forbes rates Memphis, Tennessee as one of the top real estate investment markets in the country. Memphis Investment Properties and their sister property management company, Reedy & Company Realtors, are among the largest and most trusted turnkey operations in this market. With over 30 years in business, a portfolio consisting of more than 2,700 active rentals, and an impeccable track record renovating over 6,000 single-family homes, it's no surprise they are one of the most reputable turnkey operations in the United States. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on our latest content including video tours and analysis of investment properties that are available for sale, real estate investment education, and our most interesting encounters with tenants from health. Holton Wise, real estate investing made easy.